uh, wireless. There's a video on how to do wireless if you want to know how to do wireless lighting. But um, I haven't really made much of an effort to hide the transmitter, but what the hell. Anyway, you'll notice, maybe, if you've seen the other videos, that this is, uh, again, a new place. The worlds keep corrupting or something, so I keep having to make new places um, rather than mess about in Minecraft Edit to kind of get it to work properly. So, again, this is a new building. But never mind, we'll get on with them. Get on with with the game, I suppose. So in this episode, in this video, I will show you how to do the the uh, make the high end machinery, um, like the end end game machinery type thing. It's basically upgraded versions of. The other one, so like it's an updated, um, the best furnace you can get, the best macerator you can get, that type of thing. And they are very quick and require quite a bit of power. So, uh, you know, I've got a few, there's the wireless, um, got a few high voltage just to make sure I've got the power. So, um, we'll just get on with it. Uh, right. First of all, what should we start with? Induction furnace, why not? Right, so, induction, induction, induction furnace. There are... You need, first of all, you need an iron furnace. I'm not sure if I've covered it or not, but if not, there are two ways to make an iron furnace. You can either do this, just add a no normal furnace with five irons, or you can just do a block of iron like this. Iron furnace. Right, an electric furnace is the next upgrade. Electric furnace, as you might imagine, runs on electricity. Uh, doo -doo -doo, how do you do an electric furnace? <laughs> I vaguely remember, but just to make sure, I'm pretty sure it's a... Uh, the iron furnace, an electric circuit, and a couple of redstone, yeah. Easy to make. Not expensive at all. Let's see if I can remember this. Already half forgotten. Uh, yep, there we go. Electric furnace. Alright, electric furnaces, they're, they're good. They're very good. You know, pretty good. You, know, you plunk it down, you apply some power to it, and got your upgrades. And it's, it's pretty fast as well. But. We don't want that, we want the highest. We want we want better than that. We want the induction furnace. So <laughs> I'm just gonna be even more unprofessional. Yeah, it's just uh, you take the electric furnace, an advanced machine block, I'll show you how to make that in a second. And then the rest is copper. Okay, so the advanced machine block. Just get rid of that shade. Advanced machine block. You take a normal machine block stick it in the middle and then you need advanced alloy and carbon plate now actually let's just take this to make the uh, well first of all let's just get the stuff in we need some bronze uh, we need three bronze to get bronze I think I've shown this before maybe no. But you need bronze dust anyway, you need to smelt bronze dust. To get bronze dust, it's one tin and three copper dust. Pretty sure I've shown that in a video, if not... Then I guess I'll just show you it now very quickly. <laughs> um, yeah. Um, three copper, one tin. You just go copper, 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 tin. You get bronze dust, you smelt it, you get bronze ingots. Right. We also need tin. We need three tin. And then we either need three iron or three refined iron. And I can't remember which order it is. Maybe it's refined iron. Maybe it's not that order. Um. <laughs> wow. Um. One second. <laughs> Oh, uh, it's tin on the bottom, okay. Tin on the bottom. Bronze in the middle. 
refined on the top. You got mixed metal ingots. Now have I shown you the compressor? Forgotten already. Uh, <laughs> well, if we just quickly go in here, do I have the compressor? No. I was going to make one, so I may as well make it now, actually. Wow, this is just so disorganised. Alright. Yeah, machine block, electronic circuit, three stone on either side. <sighs> Alright, and there's your compressor. Like I said, I can't remember if I've shown the compressor before. But, um, in fact, for now, just so I don't have to mess about with any wiring. Um, we'll just stick it on the roof for now. So, that, yep, that's getting power. Then you stick this in the compressor. Wait for that to do its thing. Now the other ones. Hang on. The... Where is it? Carbon plate. If I remember rightly, yep, raw carbon mesh. Which you get from raw carbon fibre, which you get from coal dust, which you get from macerating coal. <laughs> right. Um, so let's go through that again. Start off with coal. So you get a coal, put it in a macerator, and you get coal dust. You then put... Uh, doo -doo -doo. You then put four coal dust in a square, you get carbon fibre. You then use two carbon fibre to make a carbon mesh, raw carbon mesh. And then you then compress the raw carbon mesh. I guess I'll just uh, quickly show you that. Hang on. Uh, get a carbon mesh. As you can see, I've got two advanced alloy there. By crushing the mixed metal ingots. And if we crush the raw carbon mesh, we will get a carbon plate. Okay. I'm covering a lot more than I thought I would. I didn't really think this through too much, but uh, yeah, we are carbon mesh goes to carbon plate. So then we go down. Broke my leg. Go back down here. Get the advanced alloy, carbon plate, and I've forgotten. Uh, what are we making here? Oh yeah, advanced machine blocks. Actually, we need a few of these, so. I think every one of these uh, machine things, machines that we're going to be making require advanced machine blocks. So anyway, electric furnace, back to the um, good old induction furnace. Electric furnace, advanced machine block, and lots of copper ingots. Induction furnace. Beautiful. Let's just quickly uh, run this wire down. Now, I know I did say high voltage, and then they're running into an MFSU, but this is a medium voltage um, transformer. And these, um, I'm not sure if they all do, or if whether it's just... Uh, either they all run off medium voltage, or whether you might have to upgrade them, but we'll soon see. I'll, sh I'll show you how to upgrade them if, if we do. Oh, I can't really remember. So anyway, there's your induction furnace. It's not getting any power. For some reason. Because it's... Wait, hang on. No, that, sh that power should be going up. Um, let's test it, shall we? One thing you can do, which you might not have known... Get rid of flail. If you apply power to it, if you apply redstone to it, sorry. No, there needs to be power. Why is there no power? Maybe this is the wrong way around. Huh? Maybe that's just not working. 
It was working earlier. What the hell? <sighs> Bloody hell. How about now? Nope. How about now? There you go, full power. Okay, for some reason that just wasn't working. I'll just have to leave that hole in there for now. And now you see the heat going up? That only goes up when you put stuff in there to smelt. Uh, are you going to smelt my bronze dust? See, it's actually going quite slowly. That's because heat is very low. So if I just take them back out, we'll we'll wait for that heat to go back up, and then I'll show you uh, what it's like. In fact, let me just get some redstone. We'll just run some redstone in front, uh, just to power them all, because all, if not most of them... Okay, that's not going to work. There we go. <laughs> temporary, temporary. We'll let that heat... Oh, it's gone back to zero. We'll let the heat go up and we'll move on to the next one. Which, let's do the macerator. So the upgraded macerator. I've shown you how to make a macerator in the previous video. If you want to know, go watch that if, if you need to know. Um, we need an advanced machine block as usual. And... Uh, <laughs> I've forgotten again. Quickly, we shall... This is terrible. No, it's refined iron. Okay. I did think... I thought it was one of... Oh, I, I was pretty sure it was one of the irons, but I wasn't sure which. Okay, where's the advance? Rotary macerator. Now this does work. Oh, look, it's invisible. This texture. Apparently, it's something to do with the forge. The uh, yep, see, explosion. <laughs> that, my friends, is because some of these, even though they're kind of like the high-end stuff, we'll just spawn another one in. Even though it's the high-end machinery. It can only take low voltage, which is annoying, very... How did you get in here? I'm trying to hit it without breaking a block. Oh, I'm in survival at the moment anyway. Anyway, uh, what was I saying? Even though they are the highest level machines, they can only take low voltage, which is annoying as hell. But one way to fix that without having to uh, transform down to a low voltage is to make a transformer upgrade. Now, I just need to get some glass actually. Glass and I think I've got an MV transformer. If we just get some glass, dink. Okay, we'll get back to that recipe, hang on. Okay, so we need an MV transformer with two times insulated gold cable. Electronic circuit surrounded by glass. So first of all, that cable. Three gold makes a gold cable, and then you put rubber on it, or two rubber, to make this two times. And we want a few of these. Let's just make 12, since we have 12 of these gold cables. Right, and then... Now that we've got this, I think this was it. I apologise if this was not it. I can't really remember. Good. Transformer upgrade. Now we actually need a few of them, so we'll just spawn a load in. Uh, put one in there. And hopefully... Uh, hopefully... It works. Okay, beautiful. Beautiful. Where's that redstone? In fact, you know what? Alloy. Alloy wire. Alloy, alloy wire. Alloy wire is so much better. Um, <laughs> there we go. Now it'll sound as if it's on, even though it's not on. That's just because the redstone keeps it going, which goes this speed. The speed is the same as the heat on the induction furnace. So that heat's going to um, fly. 
Is there anything here we can macerate? Can we macerate stone? No. We'll just get some ore in and I'll show you how fast it goes uh, soon. No, uh, just, just gold ore, why not? So the heat starts going up, I'll show you at the end. What shall we do next? We shall do the uh, extractor next. So I have shown you the, the extractor in a previous video. If you want to see it, go see it. Uh, do 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 extractor. I have forgotten. Jesus Christ. Yeah, if you want uh, professional videos, <laughs> it's a centrifuge extractor. And it oh, I remember this. I had to. Uh, I actually forgot to set it up. Where's the uh, MFE? MFE. Alright, okay, we'll make an FM MFE because I don't think I've made one before. Ah, MFE. We've we've got the uh, gold cable, we've got the machine block, these energy crystals, it's just a diamond surrounded by redstone, it's easy. We'll just do this. Do 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 do. And they don't stack. Damn it. Uh, well, anyway, you've seen the recipe. <laughs> it's four of them crystals like this in diamond shape. Machine block in the middle, surrounded by the cable. Um, and the reason we need an MFE, I'll show you very, very soon. Is because it's the easiest way to do this. I'll just make it float for now. Uh, where's the electrolyzer? Have I made one? I don't think I've made one. No. Okay. The electrolyzer. Simply enough to make machine block, copper cables, empty cells, and a, an electronic circuit. Quickly spawn one in because I don't want to spend too long doing this. Now, when the MFE gets to about 70%, that will work. And what we need the electrolyzer for is. Where's this? Uh... What are we doing again? Centrifuge extractor. Oops. We need these electrolyzed water cells. Now, to get an electrolyzed water cell. Uh, we need water cells for a start. Water cells, they're, they're very easy to get. You basically just get an empty cell and you right click on some water. Same as like a bucket or something, a bucket. Um, see with the electrolyzer, you put the empty the water cell in, sorry, and then after a long time. Um, I don't think there's any faster way of doing this. Maybe there is, maybe there isn't. But there's no kind of recipe for electrolyzed water cells. So we'll just spawn a few in. Okie dokie. Electrolyzed water cells. Was this the shape? I can't remember. Advanced machine block. There we go. Centrifuge extractor. Now again. Oh, uh, <laughs> we'll put it here for now. I'm pretty sure that this will need a transform upgrade. Yeah. Oh, I blew up the fucking rotary macerator as well. Damn it. Okay, now. Don't not have another one. <sighs> okay. Rotary macerator. We'll just break this. Put a transformer upgrade in both so that they take medium voltage. Connect them up. And again, centrifuge extractor works like the other two. The speed goes up. Oh, I think. Yeah, anyway. Now the heat's on pretty much 100% here, so I'll just show you how quick this is. It's pretty much instant. <laughs> it's 
you see it, it's excellent, the induction furnace. And then you can just keep that going with red, red power, you don't need any. I mean, you need to keep it powered up, obviously, but it will continue to drain power. But my power's maxed out, pretty much. <laughs> and then, no, no, it's not actually using any power, because there's nothing in there to be used. But uh, yeah, they'll, so they'll increase speed with no extra power cost because of the redstone. I'm not sure if it'll cost more power, what, like the higher the speed, the more power it takes. I'm not sure, but I don't think so. Um, so now we've done those, we shall... Ooh, the next one is the compressor. Now we've seen the compressor. It's like this one up in the roof. I'm going to die if I don't get this creative mode on. This compressor, right here. Go away. Oh, no, I'm trying to get into my house. Thank you. Uh, compressor, now we need to take the compressor, surround it in obsidian, and give it an advanced machine block. Singularity compressor. Works the same as these, although it's probably going to explode. Hopefully jubbly. Wire those back up. Um, <laughs> Do -do -do. Uh, let's just break that for now. Throw that down. Put a transformer upgrade in there. And reconnect. Oops, reconnect. And then again, that works the same, the pressure goes up. Um, I think, obviously, heat's 100%, I believe the RPM goes to, to um, higher than I originally thought. Maybe it's 3,000. Um, nope, maybe it's 3,500. Maybe it's... May, no, 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 it's 7,500. It's, it's 7,500. And the pressure goes up to 75,000, I think. Uh, <laughs> Oh dear. Okay. So I think that's everything, actually. Just to prove the water salt. That goes to an electrolyzed water salt. I think that's everything. Have I covered everything? Probably. If you have any questions, just leave a comment. If you want me to cover something in particular that you're not sure of, or you want more information on it maybe, I don't know. Just, again, just leave a comment saying, I want to see this, and then I'll do it. Uh, thanks for watching. If you liked it, like the video. Uh, thanks a lot. Thanks a bunch. Love you guys. Uh, I've been Marshy. Thanks for watching.